स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू माई सेल्फ आई एम सुभाकर बावर जी वर्किंग एज ए केमिस्ट्री फैकल्टी इन फिजी विशाखापटनम सेंटर टुडे आई वुड लाइक टू शेयर अ फ्यू थिंग्स विथ दो स्टूडेंट्स हु आर अपेयरिंग फॉर जी मेन एग्जामिनेशन टू थाउजेंड एटीन या एज वी नो मैक्सिम टेन डेज आर रिमाइनिंग फॉर एस फॉर आवर प्रपरेशन आई नो यू आर ऑल वेरी बिजी विथ यूर जी मेन प्रपरेशन coming to uh, chemistry preparation as far as chemistry is concerned definitely we have to give equal importance for all the three means that physical organic as well as inorganic also generally uh, the students will give relatively less importance for those topics some topics are there just like as polymers chemistry in everyday life environmental chemistry biomolecules if you observe these topics uh, if you observe previous papers definitely one question was asked from each topic so definitely we need to concentrate on these topics also as a student uh, we feel that uh, how many revisions if we do we feel that uh, one more revision if it is there it will be good and i can able to clear the topic this topic in this way we may feel but uh, try to remember that at a particular time we need to close it we need to close your preparation next thing is uh, try to have a very clear idea about your examination center and uh, definitely ask your parent to visit the center before the examination day because uh, some disturbances uh, will be there yeah uh, whenever you are reaching to the examination center particularly the route of your examination center from your home if any disturbance is there uh, let the parents know about this if any disturbance is there then how to avoid it and definitely we must have a clear idea about that before examination day try to stop your preparation and read the instructions given in hall ticket uh, twice at least and try to understand and what you have to do on the examination day and then uh, try to have a good sleep and if it is required when compared to the other days uh, a little bit early go to bed and have a good sleep on the examination day don't skip a breakfast try to be more pleasant and make yourself a cool and calm and uh, uh, try to avoid the uh, to receive the phone calls on the examination day i know uh, definitely our well wishers will be there uh, from your friends or relatives uh, they will call you to uh, give a uh, best wishes to you definitely their best wishes they are always with you but uh, uh, don't spend more time on phone calls receiving and ask your parents to handle that part after reaching examination center definitely you can observe a very very big crowd and so many people you can observe but uh, don't become afraid of that uh, ensure that only one fourth of one fourth of the people are writing examination just like you uh, along with you your parents came in that way only parents brothers and if it is uh, neighbors also will come sometimes so don't become panic and don't be, don't be afraid of that and uh, try to be cool again and uh, try to extend to the examination center as early as possible and one more important thing is go to washroom before starting the examination why because here for the coming 3 hours you need to concentrate on the examination without any discomfort while writing examination you have to give equal importance for all the three subjects here particularly in g main examination time management plays in a very important role because we need to answer 90 questions in 180 minutes so uh, you need to keep an eye on time definitely and then the thing is uh, you can start with any subject if your favorite subject is maths you can start with maths or physics or chemistry no matter in that but uh, we need to remember one thing after 40 minutes without any emotions towards the subject to uh, without any attachment to your favorite subject definitely you need to switch over to other subject after that 40 minutes you need to go for second subject after 80 minutes a third subject you need to start in that way in the first 2 hours you you can answer reasonably very good number of questions in a single go first i am talking about first go here after that in the second go give 15 minutes for each subject again after finishing of the second go also 
15 minutes are left with you till now. So in this way, if you, if you give, then equal importance you are giving for all the three subjects. And one more thing here, uh, the G-Main examination may contain lengthy questions and some questions will be calculation based. Some questions are very easy. If we have control in your time management, then it will become very easy for you. If any question, if you find are a couple of questions or three questions, let it be. If they are very difficult and it seems to be very unknown questions to you, don't be afraid and don't be panic with that. Try to leave them. No problem. You have answered a good number of questions. So definitely they are going to be correct. And at any time, don't become panic in the examination and made yourself very strong. I wish you all the best.